Hello and welcome to another Electric World video featuring the latest news about EV World. This time, we will be discussing hot updates on Tesla's mind-blowing full self-driving beta and its best-selling car. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell. It helps you get notified when we post more content just like this. Let's get started. Elon Musk is still hyping up Tesla's upcoming full self-driving beta, claiming that Tesla Autopilot and full self-driving beta are working more accurately than humans on the highway and getting close on city streets. The updated FSD also has new visualizations. Over the last few months, Elon Musk, Tesla's CEO, has been talking about moving to the new generation, version 9, of FSD software that will eliminate the need for radar readings and instead depend on camera-based machine vision. According to CEO Elon Musk, Tesla plans to announce a new, mind-blowing version of the full self-driving beta in probably two weeks. Tesla's full self-driving software is currently in the final stages of development before being released to the public, and a select group of beta testers are responsible for assessing the performance of the FSD suite in real-world situations. Tesla's over-the-air app updates have continuously enhanced the beta program, and the next one is expected to be available for installation in possibly two weeks. According to Elon Musk, it will blow your mind. More improvements to the semi-autonomous driving suite are expected to be added to the FSD beta version 9.0 in the coming weeks. Tesla has used true owners to test the FSD features due to the use of the neural network, which captures and stores information and actions from other drivers and applies it to future situations to ensure safety. Because of the neural network, Tesla's FSD suite is constantly improving, and real-world owners are contributing to the suite's improvement and increased complexity with every mile driven. The transition to pure vision, rather than reliance on vision and radar, as Musk described in the tweet, is perhaps the most significant change that Tesla will make to the FSD beta. In the Q1 2021 update letter, Tesla went into detail about this strategy. The automaker stated, We believe that a vision-only system is ultimately all that is required for full autonomy. Our AI-based software architecture has become increasingly dependent on cameras, to the point where radar is no longer needed sooner than expected. As a result, our FSD team is fully focused on transitioning to a vision-based autonomous system, and we are almost ready to launch Tesla Vision in the US market. Tesla has long depended on cameras and radar to accurately depict its surroundings to ensure driver safety when using FSD. It is, however, considering switching to a completely camera-based approach, which could align with the Dojo Supercomputer's eventual release. Tesla introduced Dojo last year, and Musk said that the FSD suite will be improved from 2.5D to 4D. 4D is described as video essentially. Elon Musk stated, It's capable of things that if you just look, looking at things as individual pictures as opposed to video, basically, like you could go from like individual pictures to surround video so it's fundamental so the car will seem to have just like a giant improvement tesla's plan to use dojo would mean moving to 4d which would require video detection rather than radar detection this appears to be tesla and musk's final strategy for achieving the elusive level 5 autonomy rating which requires drivers to no longer pay attention to the road and the vehicle's surroundings. Although Tesla has not yet achieved this feat, 
there is no reason why it cannot do so in the future, especially as the FSD system becomes more complex over time. Another hot news is that Tesla Model 3 easily takes Q1 2021's best-selling EV title. Many people knew that Tesla did not need its flagship vehicles to help it dominate the market after the company delivered 184,800 cars in Q1, a record-setting result in terms of the company's performance. During Q1 2021, the Model S and Model X took a backseat as Tesla continued to produce the Model 3 and Model Y on a regular and accelerated basis. Tesla did not produce the two cars, and CEO Elon Musk said that his company was still ironing out some small flaws in the design of the two more expensive EVs. However, demand for the Model 3 and Model Y remained high, accounting for an overwhelming majority of the company's first quarter deliveries. Although the Model 3 has continued to dominate markets such as the United States and has competed with local, cheaper rivals such as the Wulong Hongguang Mini EV in China, the Model 3 secured its position as the most popular EV in the world in Q1, a figure that is certainly not surprising to those who are familiar with the world of electric vehicles. The Model 3 was Tesla's first mass market car with a starting price of $38,990. Tesla solved production and manufacturing flaws to successfully build and deliver the Model 3 after grinding and moving through what Elon Musk called production hell. The vehicle brought Tesla to the mainstream and became one of the many ways that the company introduced the idea of affordable electric passenger transport to the industry. As a result, Several other automakers have attempted to derail the Model 3's popularity with their own successful and cheap EVs, but none have matched the Model 3's performance, range, affordability, and quality. According to EV Sales Blog's new features, 75,888 Model 3 units were sold in March alone, making it the world's most popular EV during the third month of the year. However, as January and February are factored in, the Model 3 sedan comes out on top with 126,716 units sold in the first quarter of 2021. The figure accounts for 11% of the global EV market share for the year, with the Wuling Hongguang Mini EV coming in second with 96,674 units sold in Q1. The Model 3 wasn't Tesla's only claim to fame in the first quarter. With a third place finish, the Model Y also made an appearance on the hypothetical podium. Tesla's all-electric Model Y crossover has only been on the market for a little more than a year, but its youth hasn't prevented it from selling well. In Q1 2021, the Model Y had 56,064 deliveries, a significant lead over the fourth place BYD Han EV, which had just 21,354 units delivered. The recently published figures demonstrate the Model 3's sustained popularity, also nearly four years after it was first delivered. Tesla's development of more affordable vehicles has strengthened the company's dominance in the rapidly expanding EV market. Tesla seems to have no limit to its potential, with plans to begin manufacturing even more affordable versions in the future. That was all for today and the latest news we knew about Tesla, and thanks for watching the video. If you want to continue to learn about everything regarding Tesla's next projects and Elon Musk or electric vehicles, we've got two more video options for you on the screen to check out. And don't forget to give a thumbs up on this video if you liked it, and subscribe to our Electric World channel for daily content just like this.